Welcome to Rams Tech Channel here and today I'm in a video about the Samsung Galaxy S10 for AT&T prepaid so AT&T prepaid now has the Galaxy S10 I know that this is an older Galaxy phone but it's not available as a certified pre-owned device from AT&T prepaid it's available now for $299.99 for the 128GB version it's available in person black there so this is the Galaxy S10 from AT&T prepaid um, so this is a three-year-old device so to keep that in mind it's certified pre-owned uh, so anyways you guys get your you guys have your uh, earpiece there your hole punch from your front facing camera power button big speed button volume keys on the rest on the left side of the phone there um, you do have an in display fingerprint sensor on this phone I think the Galaxy S10 was the first Galaxy phone to have the to have an in display fingerprint sensor. So that's cool. So uh, so let's go ahead and check that out. Um, says hey, experience the next generation of Galaxy with the with the Samsung Galaxy S10, with an intelligent battery, a brilliant camera with upgradable camera features. Wireless power share and a mirror and immersive infinity display with ultrasonic fingerprint ID. You won't miss a beat. And there is talking about the AT&T. It's talking about the AT&T certified pre-owned. It, it, if you guys want to check that out, a link or a link will be down below. Or y'all got some pause the video to read what it has to say about AT&T certified pre-owned. All right. Let's continue. Um. There's a Galaxy S10, you guys have triple cameras on the back, camera flash, Samsung logo, Galaxy S10 branding on the back, right side, power button, left side, volume keys and Bixby button, um, you do have an ultrasonic fingerprint sensor in the screen, so that's cool, um, just a phone there, very nice looking phone, um, pretty good specs three years later. Uh, this was a flagship phone in 2019, of course you guys know that. Um, it, um, it got Android 12, and Android 12 is its last OS update. So to keep that in mind. Uh, specs on this phone, like I said, they're still pretty good, even though this is a 3 old phone. Um, this is an AT&T certified pre-owned phone, so that's the number one thing that you guys have to keep in mind. Uh, cinematic infinity display play like camera with upgradable features ultrasonic finger print ID so the Galaxy S10 dimensions are 5.9 inches height 2.77 inches width and 0.31 inches depth the Galaxy S10 weighs 5.54 ounces so not too bad you know pretty light you know it's not like it's not like, like really heavy or nothing like that screen size 6.1 inch dynamic AMOLED infinity display with Google Glass 6 on the front you did get a uh, quad HD plus display here 1440 by 3040 resolution 16 main colors you get three cameras on the back like I said 12 megapixel wide super speed dual pixel 16 megapixel ultra wide 123 degrees field of view 12 megapixel 2 times optical zoom Dual aperture mode with f1.5 and f2.4. Epic shot camera with scene optimizer. 10 megapixel UHD selfie so you, you can record 4K videos on, on the front camera. Video record, video playback, uh, shooting options, AR emoji, food, hyperlapse. Live focus, panorama, photo, pro, slow motion, super slow mo, and video. Battery is a 3400mm battery, which is not removable. A uh, 3400mm battery is kind of small in today's standards, but back then that was pretty decent. This was a flagship frame back in 2019, of course. Y'all guys know that. Y'all should know everything about the Galaxy S10 devices here. A uh, 3400 mm battery that's a bit small in today's standards, pretty much laughable in today's standards. 34 hours of talk time. And there's your standby time there, they always fuck it up for some goddamn reason. Audio playback 47 hours on the speaker, 
One three hours on the headset. It, it is wireless charging capable, fast charging, 31 minutes to 50%, and 95 minutes to 100%. Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 processor, which is an optical chip charger, a three year old processor that was a flagship processor in 2019. 128 gigabytes of storage, 5 gigabytes of expandable storage, rear micro SD. 8 gigabytes of RAM, Android 12 on board, One UI 4.1, I believe it is. And like I said, Android 12 is its last OS update on the Galaxy S10 series. So to keep that in mind, alright. Um, you do get 4G LTE on here. Uh, you, you, you don't get 5G on this phone, but you can get 5G enhanced. On the Galaxy S10e for some crazy reason, that's kind of weird. Um, but uh, you don't get 5G on this line. It would not be until the Galaxy S20 5G that Samsung released a 5G phone on the Galaxy S20 series. So yeah, uh, you do get 4G, 3G, GSM of course. It's a wall phone, quad band, AC voice. Wi-Fi calling, AT&T video call, Wi-Fi connection, A two eleven ABGN, AC, IRAX, dual band Wi-Fi, NFC, Bluetooth 5.0, low energy, 10 devices for a mobile hotspot, wireless emergency alerts, of course it takes a nano SIM card, it's pretty much standard now, and it's been a standard for the last several years now on phones. Um, you do get apps from AT&T and Samsung pre-installed. Uh, some of these apps are outdated and no longer exist. So to keep that in mind, uh, from from app, the apps that you guys get from AT&T or AT&T Car Protect, Device Out, Drive Mode, Mobile Security, Protect, Secure Family, Setup and Transfer, Smart Wi-Fi. Watch TV, which is, I don't think, it, it that, that does not exist anymore, either. Bleacher Report, Bleacher Report Live, CNN, DC Universe, Direct TV Now does not exist anymore. It's Direct TV Stream Now. Direct TV Remote does not exist anymore. Or maybe it does, I'm not sure about that one. Game of Thrones Conquest, Great Big Story, HBO Go is no longer a thing. It is, um, it is now... HBO Max, uh, Mobile Services Manager, NCAA March Madness Live. <coughs> the Samsung apps that you guys get, of course, is the Galaxy Wearable, Samsung Health, Samsung Calculator, Samsung Members, but the Samsung Plus or whatever, Samsung Nets, Samsung Pay, Samsung Smart, Samsung Smart Switch, and Smart Things from Samsung. Additional apps, obviously, there's are like your standard Google apps. So you get Amazon Shopping, Facebook, Google Drive, Google Duo, Google Maps, Google Pay, Google Photos, Google Play Movies and TV, which is no longer a thing. It is now Google TV now. Google Play Music is no longer a thing. It is now YouTube Music. Google Play Store, obviously. Google Search, Spotify, YouTube. My AT&T provides fast, easy account access virtually anywhere, anytime. Web browsers, Samsung browser, Google Chrome on board, sensors, etc. Remember, ambient light, barometer, gyroscope, heart rate sensor. So, pretty interesting. Messaging, your music part of it is Google Play Music on here, but it's actually YouTube Music now. Like I said, this one is three years old. So, some apps or don't exist anymore or they've been updated to different names and stuff like that uh, accessibility sustainability product cage and stuff like that what comes in the box is a charging brick USB-C cable and your SIM card and that's pretty much it for the box there uh, so yeah there you guys have it AT&T prepaid now has the Galaxy S10 on its own, it's available now for $299.99. This is a certified pre owned device, so to keep that in mind, it's still getting updates. Of course, it only um, runs Android 12 right now, which Android 12 will be 
updated slash OS update on the Galaxy S10 series of phones. So do keep that in mind. So yeah, there you guys have it. Samsung Galaxy S10 certified pre-owned. Now available on AT&T prepaid. So if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up guys. If you me a lot, please rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.